today we had just enough snow to tie today's record. Now in November, those records are really not all that impressive compared to what we see later on in the winter season. Uh, today's record only 0.8 inches of snow that was set in 2014. Uh, so managed to tie that this afternoon. We really don't have much evidence of it because that snow melted as soon as it hit the ground for the most part, thanks to temperatures being above freezing. But kind of an interesting little note for today. Again, we had record tying snowfall. More snow coming tomorrow, just similar to today. Just mainly looking at flurries, but we're gonna have to factor in some gusty winds at times. Uh, so between the wind and those flurries coming through, there is a slight chance for snow squall activity, and we'll kind of explain what that is as uh, the weather cast goes along. But for right now, mainly cloudy, dry tonight, 25 coming for the overnight low. So a brisk start to tomorrow, looking at wind chills in the teens in the morning. Uh, so make sure you've got those extra winter layers handy. Uh, may not be fully practiced on that yet, but uh, we are definitely looking at a lot of chilly weather to get you ready for the winter season. Next weather system still over the Great Plains. There's some Arctic air coming behind that, so that could have set us up for record cold temperatures in the coming days. And just think back to last week, we were talking record warmth. So in the span of about 7 to 10 days, we flipped from record warm to record cold. That's the trend we'll be on for the rest of this week. Now about the snow, not likely to happen until after about 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock in the morning. So the early morning hours staying dry. And then this is a great example of what we'll see through the day tomorrow. These little bursts of snowfall, mostly as flurry activity, but they could be just a little heavier than that. Uh, so we're not getting a ton of accumulation, but that snow may come down just fast enough combined with the gusty winds to cause pretty hard to see conditions. Uh, so we'll have to be careful with this over the course of tomorrow. Any lingering flurry activity should be done by the time we get to tomorrow evening and then we're fully dry going into the weekend. So a chance for gusty snow showers. So a lot of wind blown snow or even some uh, a slight chance for a snow squall. It just means hard to see conditions, slick spots throughout the afternoon. And now if we do get into a true snow squall, that is like a mini blizzard. So it's an intense burst of snow. Conditions change suddenly. Uh, they are pretty short. Within an hour or less, they're in and out. But during that time, 50 mile an hour wind gusts, whiteout conditions, the road conditions changing from dry to possibly an inch or more of snow within a half an hour. So very quick, very fast hitting, and that can cause some dangerous conditions. Again, just a slight chance that we'll see that, but still wanted to make sure that you're ready just in case. 32 for the high temperature tomorrow under those cloudy and breezy conditions. And then we're looking at possibly near record cold going into the weekend. Uh, the next couple days, the records are in the 20s, and that's our forecast. 20s for highs going into the weekend, but then we warm up after that. 40s back by next week in your most accurate 10 day forecast. The weather looks to be right around average into the middle of next week. Dry for the holiday travel for now, but then keep an eye on Thursday. That does have a chance for a rain snow mix, uh, so Turkey Day could be just a little slushy. We'll have to keep an eye on that. Meantime, four degree guarantee. We are forecasting 30s, so that sounds warm compared to what we have later this week. By the way, cash total up to 65 bucks. Right. Holding on to the 30s for as long as we can, aren't we? Right, because that feels warm compared to 20s. Yeah, record we were, cold later this week. We were holding week. on to the 70s just so short ago. Oh, we knew those 70s were not going to last. Yeah. Okay, I can't talk about I can't talk about weather anymore. Let's